All right, guys, it is week 13, and this is the I Analyze iRacing Rough Cup. And uh, basically, I had to do one I Analyze iRacing, I Analyze Racing race in order to be entered into the contest to uh, win all of the content that iRacing has to offer. That is the contest for the season. Usually, they just uh, make you put a a uh, certain advertiser on your car for eight weeks out of a season but this time they actually want you to participate in a week 13 race and rather than doing another plate track which I'm really getting sick of in the ovals I'm gonna do Watkins Glen here in the rough and it is rough there's a car number three which is not good and there's a lot of bad drivers behind me so God, I'm not looking forward to this. And this is a standing start. I believe. Yep, it is. Green flag. Did not practice for that. Left side. Still there. You are clear. On your left. Three wide. Three wide. Still there. Clear all the round. On your left. Still there. Still there. Gonna have a car off to the right. Clear. Keep coming. This car is very understeery, under braking. I mean, it's horrible under braking. So I brake very, very early and roll into the corner. Because I do not want to be braking in the corner. And this is an official race. It's not one of the standard Week 13 fun runs. It is an official race, so... Whatever happens here is going to affect my I rating and my safety rating. You can see a lot of people are having issues. On your right. Clear, clear, clear. I didn't fight him for that. If I'd have fought him for that, I don't know who he's talking to. On your right. Clear, clear. Drive through it. This is ridiculous. <laughs> These cars under braking. I mean, they are seriously something else. In front of you. In front of you. Got a slow one. Keep going. Wow. You can see the car trying to turn.
side. Still there. Clear, clear, clear. I think that's the same guy that dive bombed me a few minutes ago, so he can go where he wants to. I'll let him dive bomb somebody else. So iRacing's latest build. What a catastrophe that turned out to be. They were down for a couple days. When they came back up, everybody's complaining about problems with their system. We're gonna have a car off to the right. And I am definitely having issues with frame rate on mine. Every few seconds I'll get uh, freeze frames. It's not horribly bad, but it's enough that I had to lower the resolution in the game. I'm used to playing on 1080p and now I'm playing on 720p. I'm supposed to come out come out with a fix for it tomorrow. Left side. Still there. Clear. Tenth person I've avoided coming off the 90. That's nice work. Let's go get that next one. I don't think I've ever seen this many wrecks in a single race in a long time. You know when I have somebody coming up really fast behind me and they're not lapping me? It makes me think they've already clear, done something clear. stupid. So putting up a fight's just ridiculous.
trying to be very smooth because the understeer, I mean the oversteer under braking is ridiculous. If this was an open series, I would actually make some adjustments to uh, brake bias. See if I can clean it up a little bit because it's awful. Oh, I wish I had a shift light.
your eyes open. Keep coming. You're gonna have a car off to the right. He's moving, he's moving. Thank you. Take the inside, brother. He caught me pretty fast. I don't want to hold him up. I don't want him to hit me. Thank you. On your left. Clear. You know, it's funny, when I race this track in the uh, NASCAR trucks, there was understeer under uh, acceleration, and with these cars, there's oversteer under braking. If I stay in the position I'm in, I'm going to pick up some decent points because there's 24 people in this room. So, I'm in the top 10, I'm in the points. I'm thrilled. cars have new tire sounds. I don't know if you can hear it, but you can hear the tires scrubbing a lot better now. So it gives me an idea of what uh, what the car is doing a little bit better. One thing I do like about this car, even though it's uh, oversteery, under braking, under acceleration, you can just about put your foot down as soon as you want to. He came out of the pits. Now he's going to go right back in. Yeah, it jumped right out and got you, man. I saw that. It's a shame, too. You're pulling away from me. He's 
Okay, he's moving, he's moving. Uh, keep going, keep going. The uh, Alicentra, Alicentra, however you pronounce it, grips on my on my uh, steering wheel have gotten loose. I'm gonna have to rip them off and maybe use some hockey tape or something to retape my grips. Focusing on just being smooth. That is what my entire focus is on. I'm not trying to be fast. Just trying to be smooth. And hold that wheel straight under braking. What that white flag sure didn't go do that. What that white flag signifies, for those of you who don't know, is that your uh, bump and run capabilities are now engaged. So you you bump the guy that's in front of you because you're fat, you're you think you're faster than him, and you move him out of your way, and then you go on by because you can't pass him legitimately. So that's what that is. In case you were wondering. Six and zero incidents. Works for me. I'll take it. No 
Don't hear me complaining. Pick a flag. You see that frame drop there? It's because of that smoke. Very nice work, my man. Good solid day. Oh, I got fifth. I thought I had sixth. I got P P5. Hey guys, just want to give you a real quick uh, example of why it is that a lot of times I do not defend on road courses against people I don't know. Um, if we're in a league race with guys that I know, I will defend. But a lot of times when I see somebody really fast like this guy coming up behind me, I'll let him have whatever line he wants and I'll just hold my own line. And this is why. I break at my usual point. He flies by and immediately goes off track and I have my regular line. And the same thing is going to happen up here in turn one. I hold my normal line, break at my normal breaking point. And this really fast guy crashes equally as fast. Now there, I held on to the position without ever blocking, without ever defending, and I drive out of it unscathed. 